Hey guys, uh, got some big news. Uh, I've traded this 1985 Chevy C10 truck that goes by the name of Walter. I've traded it to GM1038 on YouTube. Check out his channel, GM1038. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm trading him this for his uh, 1988 Chevy OBS truck. And uh, I'm giving him everything that I have bought for this truck to go along with the trade. Uh, I've, of course, I got the door locked, but I got my new carpet in here, if you'll remember. Got new carpet for the truck. And, uh, see, what else was I... Anyway, there's some more stuff. Extra set of keys. Just, just different different little things. Don't really amount to a whole bunch, but I'm trading this truck for his OBS truck. Now, I've never had an OBS truck. Always wanted one. But I'm kind of picky about who I... Uh, you know... Vehicles I don't know I try to get from friends and I know GM Tim 38 and he's very very picky So I've done some trading with him. He's going to be getting this truck. I don't know what his plans are for this truck just yet I think he said something about lowering it and putting some 20 inch wheels on it. I think it would look really really good that way, but I don't know What what his plans are he he's kind of like me sometimes we <laughs> sometimes we get ideas in our heads and then sometimes it doesn't materialize so anyway check out his channel and you can figure out what he's going to do with this truck the next time he puts a video up i'm pretty sure i would think that he'd be talking about this one but uh i'm going to miss walter it's been a good truck but it's not like it's went that far it's just a county or two over from me and uh, i don't know what like i said i don't know what brian's going to do with the truck but uh, it should be interesting. I do, I, I do know that the, the spring rod run in Pigeon Forge is coming up soon. So I don't know if he, I don't know if he's going to take this up there or what. You know, he's got, he'll have two square bodies as far as I know at the moment. Uh, uh, 83, the blue one, and then he'll have this one. And I'll have my very first uh, OBS truck, so... Kind of excited to, I'm speaking for myself, I mean, Brian's had a lot of different cars and trucks, but I've never had an OBS, and uh, Brian has built that OBS truck, you know, motor and transmission, rebuilt the transmission, and it still likes a few little minor things. I'll have to put exhaust and stuff like that on it, but it's, there's no big hurry on the exhaust because he's been driving it, he's drove it a long way, probably five, six, seven hundred miles, so... Uh, but I mean, I'm I'm the kind of guy, you know. I'd uh, I'll finish it up, you know, where the exhaust is stopped. I'll finish it up and go on out the back, about like I do all the rest of them that I have. So I'm anxious to to get it and uh, looking forward to it. And I hope that I'm hoping he's looking forward to Walter. Uh, me and him, it's, this is not the first time we've traded. <laughs> not 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 by a long shot. Every year seems like we trade something for something i don't know i traded a what did i do see i bought a 69 step side truck no that was from charlie uh see i traded a 57 chevy truck i know for the 79 c10 truck ruby and then i we've done a bunch of trading uh, i traded for this dang i'm standing right beside it traded for this and uh real happy to have this truck here coffee so uh anyway brian's a stand-up guy is what i'm trying to say and i i don't mind getting anything from him because he's a real good mechanic and i i'm not i'm not a mechanic whatsoever so we'll see what it turns out like i'm awful anxious to get it and i hope that he's as anxious as i am to get walter here i think he'll take it to the next level and uh if you think you might want won't excuse me if you think you might want walter when uh gm 1038 gets it brian i would suggest you contact him asap and see what he wants to see what he's going to do with it i don't know that he will sell it but we'll, we'll just have to see what happens it'll be interesting i'm going to i told him over the phone that uh 
he's probably going to make this look really killer and i'm probably going to be wishing i had this one back but i never have had an obs truck before and i'm just anxious i've heard him talk about sam that's the name of his obs truck sam this is walter i always name all my stuff he does too so uh i'm just anxious to get it and have something different to play with kind of makes you spice up your life just a little bit with uh, different vehicles that's how we that's how we roll just kind of change it up a little bit amongst our friends and i mean he he knows i'm not a mechanic and uh, i know that he is <laughs> kind of a kind of one-way street isn't it but no I, I always tell everybody what i think something needs as best i can tell so uh, I just got exhaust put on this truck and new mufflers and a sport bumper on the back. That's normally when you get things like that done, it's time to trade. <laughs> uh, but anyway, it is what it is, and I'll be happy to get the OBS truck and play with it. I've, uh, like I said, I've never had one. I'm, I guess you can tell I'm kind of excited about it. Y'all's probably laughing at me, but I don't know. I'm, I might get might start getting into OBS trucks. Who knows? I always, I've had 57s. I, 55 through 59s mostly 57s then i went to 67 kind of jumped the other ones there 63 4 5 even though i like them never had a chance to get one that i could afford but i went from 67 to 72 and now square bodies and now my first obs truck so who knows who knows what's going to happen it's all up in there but just wanted to share this little bit of information with you i hope guess you can tell i'm excited like i said i, I talk a lot so i'm going to hush if you would like to subscribe to my youtube channel uh primer is best uh when i get the truck home i'll make a video of it and uh you know we can have fun talking about it and looking at it and stuff like that so that's just anyway you're watching primer is best if you'd subscribe i sure would appreciate it I don't mean to repeat myself so much, but really, if you'd subscribe, it sure would help my channel a whole bunch, truly. And uh, I have a second YouTube channel called Man on a Budget. I'm on uh, Instagram, Primer is Best, and Instagram, Man on a Budget 1. And I'm also on Facebook, Primer is Best. If you'd like to check me out, I'd appreciate it. Don't forget, once again, I don't mean to be beating a dead horse, but... Check out GM Tim 38, GM Tim 38 on YouTube. I, I would appreciate it very much if you'd subscribe to his channel. He's, golly, he's a stand-up guy, and I'm, I, I tell him all the time how blessed I am to have, have him for my friend. I've got some really good friends in my life, and uh, I don't like to be around people. It's got a lot of drama, and stuff like that going on, and all, all my friends are pretty much the same every day, and I try to be the same every day. Uh, anyway i'll hush y'all have a wonderful day the lord is in charge and i'm so glad that he is we're fixing to get some more storms i know i say that a lot but golly it's just one right after the other y'all have a i gotta get rid of that water but what's the what's the point y'all have a great day god bless y'all i'll catch you in the next one i'll see y'all later